Welcome back to Star Sector, folks. We are heading over to colonize another planet. We have Odin and Freya colonized, and now we are going to colonize this guy, Alpha Dnieper 2. Now, Alpha Dnieper 2 only has a hazard rating of 125%. It has trace volatiles, which is fine, but it also has like a floating continent, meaning Continent minus 50% hazard rating, high gravity, uh, it's cold, but 125% hazard rating and only the trace volatiles. We have volatiles elsewhere, I believe, abundant organics. We have a volatiles here, right? Yeah, abundant volatiles. So we don't even need to, to use those trace volatiles. So I'm thinking that... Alpha Dnieper 2 here will be our main industry planet. So we'll have uh, light industry, heavy in industry, uh, stuff like that yeah. on here. And probably also uh, the, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, not that. The military base and so on. So that's the plan. That is the plan. Let's uh, give you some more growth incentives. Give you some more growth incentives. We already have refining here at Odin. So we don't need that on Freya. So we could do fuel production on Freya. Or commerce. We'll see. We'll see when the time comes. Anyway, right now we are heading over here. Uh, establishing a colony. I already recruited the extra people that we need and stuff like that. So let's establish a colony here. And it is going to be uh, Haldia. Haldia. All right, you are getting growth incentives. And once that's done, we'll start getting the infrastructure up on this guy. So that's our third colony in this system and our last colony in this system. Next, we'll have to expand, but they are nice and close together. And these two planets are actually orbiting Haldia. So Freya and Odin is actually orbiting Haldia, which is nice. So they'll stay together and protected at all times which I like okay next pirate base so right over here let's deal with that bad boy and then after that oh there's a little pirate guy there there's a freighter there. Let's more of that. Take all of that. And there's some debris here. Let's just. Oh, you. A razorback. Not sure I've seen that before. All right. Uh, well, let's just head out of here and deal with that pirate base we'll jump in here I think let's ping real quick uh, Heart base could be out there. Uh, 
Let's just hack that. See this pirate base here? It is. Uh, it's just a one sided one. We'll send me and. No, I'm more than enough, but just to move things along, let's try sending the Enlightenment and see what that looks like. In battle. Come on, let's get up there. There it is. Enlightenment's PD is pretty crazy. Four, one. Okay. Come on, pirate base. So this was a colony threat that we wanted to get rid of before we move into the core systems to to sell off that or to do our delivery mission we have a delivery mission for 267,000 which is quite nice it's easy money Oh, it's overloaded. There we go. Claim victory. Pick through the wreckage. Nothing much there. But Jakob leveled up, though. So it was worth taking in the Enlightenment. Um, fleet. You have a level up, Jakob. Uh, let's get gunnery Im implants three, helmsmanship three. He has some very nice, uh, very nice uh, skills. Okay, now. Uh, where is it that we need to deliver that stuff? Mm. Atka. Uh. Okay. Uh, go to system map. This. That's not where we're going, we're going there. All right. Let's head in there and deliver that. And then I think it's... I think it's about time that we do some of the story missions. And then get involved with a little bit more involved with the wars going on. Uh, try and help uh, Sylphen and so on. Uh, try and get into the alliance with Sylphen and Tritachion. I really want to get into that alliance. All right, two hundred and sixty-four thousand there. We need anything? Uh, let's just get everything here. Sell that off. Okay. Yeah, we'll keep all that. So. Let's quickly see. Uh, 
Matt. Now, it seems there's a mission. Pirate base. What's the mission over at that? Um, hmm. Okay, we're at war with the Samara clan, I guess. Who's in the Samara clan? Uh, diplomacy, actually, we want alliances. Samara clan is hegemony and pack. Okay. But. I think I want to get rid of the stipend. Uh, I'm not going to go do that. I really want to know what... Why is that marked with an exclamation mark I don't know if anyone knows why that would be marked with an exclamation mark I would love to know so uh, leave a comment if you do I would be very grateful I think we'll go do a story mission a promise Ascent of Adventure, Red Planet. Oh, it's because we have to go talk to the guy there. That's why. Talk to the pilot at Cold Rock. All right, so I know why it's marked with an exclamation mark. Let's go talk to the pilot. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, why can't I talk to the pilot? Oh, that's who I need to talk to. Okay, 17,000. So now we have the red planet. Okay. Don't want to sell anything to the pirates. All right, let's jump out here. Uh, we lost money there. Yeah, one hundred fifty-seven thousand. I've been I filled up quite a bit. Red planet. Oh, the red planet is up there. Okay. Well, the promise is nearby, so let's explore promise. Uh, with our sustained burn on, of course. It'll take a while to get there if we don't have that. Man, this is a thick cloud. 
Jesus, this is a thick cloud. And there comes one more. Oh, there's a, a remnant. Suborder, I guess. It wasn't big enough to be an order, I think. All right, explore a promise. We are gonna do that. Yep, we are heading in here. Uh, Delta Mendel. Uh, hmm. All right, we are exploring a promise. There are no ruins on any of those. There's something up here though, a minor supply cache. Let's check that out. Discovered anomalous station. I guess that's what we're looking for. We don't rock a rock hound. Okay. And then there's an anomalous station down here. What's that? Oh wait, before we do that, I haven't saved in quite a while. Just in case something breaks or something. Whoa! Or oh, they have a fleet like that. Okay. Rapid shield emitter, volatile flux core, that's good. Sluggish vent valves, that's good. Agile, not good. Deadly, not good. Powerful capacitors, not good. Stable shields, not good. Good. Powerful shields, not good. All right, we'll engage. I think this is going to be a tough battle, guys. You are going in. You are going in. Hmm. We could get the other equilibrium in as well, but then we don't have any fighters. I want fighters. So I think we'll get you in and you in. Takes us down to a five star battle. Okay. You support me, you support me, you support me. I will, there's no points of interest. So I'll just head up there, actually head up there because I don't want to be too close to uh, to the um, to the escape point or the edge of the map because then I think we're in danger of being trapped. Uh, let's put strikes on you and you. I'll head up front to bear the brunt of it, I think. Mm. Stop flying into me. Stop pushing me forward. I don't want to be pushed forward. Alright, he's pulling back. In that case, we'll focus on you. Alright, he is taking quite the pounding up there. Which is good. Let's focus on you. Get you down if we can. That's down. Let's do a quick vent while we're able to. And let's focus you again. I've already used my sabos because I was on the wrong thing. He is taking some damage up there. 
Good. It's taking some real damage. I love it. Get out of my way, you little bastard. Let's take you out. Right, that thing is down. All right. In that case, we'll take out the Brilliant here. The Lumen was destroyed. Another Lumen was destroyed. I really want that Brilliant down. So the Solar Class was destroyed. Let's do a quick vent while we can here. The Big Boy was destroyed. Awesome. That guy is basically destroyed. We're overloaded. Let's keep targeting you. Nice. Let's target you. Nice. All right. Those guys are down. Here comes a lot of fighters. He's going down. This Lustrare, or however it's pronounced. Lustrare, I don't know. Okay, he's down. I want you down because you're a carrier. Okay. Let's see. Put a strike on you, a strike on you. All right, so this brilliant is taking a beating now. All righty. He is half dead. Let's focus on someone a bit closer. Ah, damn it. There we go. Brilliant down. Another brilliant going down. The equilibrium is just too powerful. Ooh. I love this ship, but I do think it's the Ceres Valla who deserves, uh, that deserves most of the credit for it, still. It's just such a useful ship, the Ceres Valla, taking away a lot of the flux that I would normally be generating. Alright, that thing is down come on there we go let's take you down there we go let's take you down all right he's taking a pounding nice since he pulled back, we'll focus on you instead. Let's put a strike on you and a strike on you. That brilliant is taking a beating as well. Very nice. Oh, finish it, please. There we go. Sersvala is holding its own, probably not doing the most damage in the world, but it's doing its part. It is doing its part. I do need to vent soon. Okay. 
started taking a bit of hull damage. Let's just quickly vent here. While we're in a safe spot. Brilliant taking a beating. A heavy beating. There it goes. Let's focus the shimmer. Stop jumping around like that shimmer. I can't hit you when you do that. Alright, shimmer taking a beating. Wonderful. There we go, shimmer destroyed. We have a brilliant there, brilliant there. Let's head over and deal with this brilliant. Brilliant is down. Oh, here comes the big boy. Here comes the big boy. Let's deal with you as fast as we can. Uh, let's put strike on you and strike on you. So far, this battle is going well. Very well. Alright, he is starting to take some physical damage. And not shield damage. Oh, he's pulling back. We're not gonna let him though. He is not enjoying himself right now. Okay. There goes the brilliant. And here goes the solar. And that's the battle. Claim victory. Everything was destroyed. We didn't take any kind of damage whatsoever. Physical only shield damage, it seems like. And we got metals, locust, paladin, plasma cannon. Well, nothing too interesting from that. I would have hoped for some cores. All right, Paris leveled up. In salvage operations. Ooh. Sierra Core. What's a Sierra Core? Mm, you know, although this Sierra Stamp AI Core shares many similarities to an Alpha Core, it's not entirely clear what its purpose is, and it gives off a variety of an anomalous signals that suggest it's related to phase technology. Connected, it, connecting it to a, any of your ship's systems is impossible as the wires are firmly attached and are incompatible with your own. Nonetheless, it is likely to be it is likely of value to someone. Handing it off to a major sector power seems irresponsible. Okay. And some blueprints. And Warlost Wing, already known. Popish Wing, already known. Mentiday Wing. Uh, we don't know that. Manti Day. That looks interesting. Uh, Sylphan Common Tech Blueprint Package. We already know. Corrupt Nano Forge. Sylphan Prototype Null Point Shields Mod Spec. Okay. Shield damage taken is reduced by 50% and absorbed. Mm. Absorbed damage is prepared it's discharged as bolts of null space lightning at any target in front of the ship. 
Okay. Okay, we'll learn it. Uh, reinforced mount suspension and sulfur prototype micro null space shunt. It allows the ship to increase flux dissipation by 50% percent through converting soft flux into hard flux. Okay. These are all interesting. We'll learn them. All are known, learn that. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Brilliant. Uh, nothing too interesting there. Okay. So that's that. Is there anything else around here? Nothing on those planets. Let's lay in a course for that planet. Mining at Freya complete. Let's just take a look at our colonies. Heldia has its spaceport. We'll add a way station. And then Freya was done with mining. Uh, you want to get fuel production? Suppose we do. I really do want heavy industry sooner rather than later though. Now we could put fuel production and light industry commerce and the military base over here. Yeah, so Freya, heavy industry, you need to upgrade you to a battle station as well. That'll be the next project. Alrighty, we have up here, no ruins, oh, maybe ruins. Uh, let's just see. It's kind of hard to see. Nah, no ruins. Only asteroids. Let's head into the sun and have a look. Nah, nothing. Alright. I guess we'll transverse jump out. Star Fortress at Odin done. Very nice. I think we'll build some ground defense. You're only colony size five still. We're at sixty seven percent though. And column size 6 doesn't give us an extra in industry slot. We might as well explore these four, right? Now we have a character point. Minus 50% chance of malfunction, we'll take it. All right, Nemesine. Let's just do a quick save. 
We're down to 143,000, which isn't great, but we are building a lot. Let's do a ping. Nothing. We'll have Volcanic World, Volcanic World, Barren World, Volcanic World. Volcanic Worlds can be quite good in my experience. So we'll check those out. I think I will survey them. Just because I know they can be quite good. Ultra rich rare or ultra rich ore. Class four, see? They can be quite good. Let's ping. Form survey, rich, rare ore, abundant ore. Oh, did I just turn off that? We'll survey everything in here, I guess. Moderate ore, sparse, rare ore. This guy needs to have some volatiles or something. Nope, abundant rare ore, rich ore. All right, and if we do a ping, there's nothing. So we'll just head out right here at this jump point. And we'll head up here. Uh, that's um, some kind of warning beacon. We saved, so let's just head in. Just that. Nothing too interesting. And none of these have ruins. There's something up here though, a habitat. Gamma core. Right, I guess we'll take everything. Still wasn't too interesting. And we'll do that again. Likely, but high risk. Let's not. Let's head down here, then we'll can head in there after. Yeah. Let's do a ping. What's this out here? There's something here. Destroyer. Nah. Don't need destroyers. We're kind of past the point of destroyers being useful to us, I think. They're still useful, but not as useful as they once were. You have ruins. Diffuse volatile, scattered ruins, flowing continent. So that's actually quite nice. What are you? Hexafire scatter cannon. Okay. I apologize for the ambulance that you can possibly hear in the background right now. I guess that you can. Hope whoever is in it or is being picked up is going to be okay. All right, anarchist camp. Should we take out that anarchist camp? I 
suppose it can't hurt. Or can it? That's a weird station. Hmm. All we can do in, is engage it. Let's let's engage it. Uh, not transfer command. Uh, what's in me? You, you. Uh, let's take the discernment. I don't know if that's the right move. Uh, attacking that but I guess we'll find out right, let's get up there wow that is a long laser that he has oh, Jesus speeding up to two just to get up there okay let's put a strike on you That's the first bit down. I think I have fought one of these before, haven't I? I think I have. I'm not entirely sure though. Get out of my way, debris. Alright, there's another bit down. Third bit is taking a beating, a heavy beating, mostly from the fighters. Stop pushing me forward, you bastard. It's like, hey, get in there. You get in there. You take care of my flux. Stop pushing me forward, you annoying. Right, another bit is down. Right, another bit is down. I need to vent. I have to vent. Okay. And the last bit is down. Claim victory. The anarchists probably don't like us particularly much, but it's their problem. If you don't like us, then you can rest in peace, basically. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there anything else we want to take a look at here? I don't think so. Oh, there's something up here. Might be an anarchist fleet, but might be something else interesting. It is something else interesting. A mining base. Insulation, insulated engine assembly. Okay, I guess we'll learn that. We'll take everything. And... Oh, another uh, dampened mount. Extra recoil dampeners fitted around the mounts allow projectile weapons to fire at a slightly extended range. Okay. Not too interesting, really. Alright, there was something pinging out here as well. Don't know if it was something of interest or what was. There's something 
up here at the sun though or the oh a debris field let's have a look at that I wonder what that um, Sierra core is for Right, we made 200,000. All right, we'll explore Alpha Mendel as well, and then we'll head home, I guess. Well, we have been playing for a long time, guys. Uh, I think we'll have to do that in the next one, because we are way over time. Well, when you're having fun, you know. So anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.